What's oh, going on, y'all? We need air conditioning. And she's panicking already. It's hot. It is a little warm. Buddy, you ready to go to the race? Yay. What about you, Sissy? You ready to go see Vroom Vrooms? Yay. <laughs> she don't know. If any of you might be wondering what this is. That's Turkey's first turkey. <laughs> Sean's mom's neighbor. Amanda and them got this for Colton a long time ago. And that was his first little like turkey toy, and so it has stayed right there. I got Chloe's for, first hair bow. Yeah, he's got Chloe's first hair bow over there. So that turkey has been there for like two years now. If anybody's wondering what that big we had just got behind is sticking back. up. Every time I look out the window, I just see <laughs> turkey behind sticking up in the air. I'm gonna fix him setting up, that way he's chilling and hanging out and he's comfortable. Y'all, Sean's mind is already on food. He's like, so so what do you say we go get something to eat after this? I could use a filly and a salad. I like to eat. You gonna be able to manage long? Yeah. Is I'm your good. belly gonna get to you? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. <gasps> are you ready to race? Uh, Cece, are you ready to go watch a race? Fist bump. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I know you hear it. These fairgrounds got hit really hard, you guys. They're starting to clean it up, but I don't know if you guys can see the, like it completely off its foundation and twisted up. Is it good, bud? <laughs> Is it nummy? Good thing we're going home after this. No what do you think of it, Cece? <laughs> Is that a good lemon? Is it sour? Oh, God. <laughs> She's giving it a hard way to go. We stayed for an hour and a half or so. I really couldn't get much footage. Like, they done pretty good, but they were restless. The kids was restless. They was trying to run everywhere. They wouldn't stay in their little wagon thing. So it made it difficult to try to even film anything. So we just, I put it Colton up on my shoulders. We went and stood there, watched some of the races going on. And I just got your recycled lemon, huh? <laughs> you just give daddy a Is that how it works <laughs> now? Well, you, you are <laughs> soaked. So next race, I think we're actually just going, me and Megan will get mom to watch the kids. Are you okay? Are you hungry? I just seen one of my friends from all through school, kindergarten to graduation. But I thought, I was like, did I see your husband down there? She's like, yeah, they're down there. I knew it was them. Help me, Dada. I got it. Here, Minnie Mouse. Bubba, you want some more? So anyways, what we decided, we do want to get some super good footage down there, some killer shots, you know, everything. So next race, the next one, we are going to leave the kids, probably with Mama or my sister, but it was very awesome to see the kids down there having a good time. All the little, the mini races is the best. The, yeah, the mini races, the teeny weenies, it's so cute. But it's just good to see everybody down there enjoying something again you know that's the best part is it good you know these is only supposed to come out like once every so many like 14 17 years Floods got them draw back out. <laughs> what do you think, dude? What's up? Having a Monday. It's always a Monday. So Lori's getting a taste of my world. <laughs> my world is anything that can go wrong will go wrong. It's all right. We manage and we work through it. Look at that. It's turned out nice. 
Yes, indeed. These are turning out super nice. Oh, yeah. Look at that. And that print will be on there for a long time. Hi. Hi. <laughs> What's up, bud? What? I'm dead ass. No. You been running around with Mamma? Oh, you having yeah, a good Daddy, time? We go get bye -bye. Pizza Hut. Pizza. <gasps> you go get pizza. Yeah. 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 Was it good? Yay. Yay. <laughs> I, I thank you for thinking of Dada. <laughs> oh, it was Mamma's fault. You sure it wasn't Mama? What are you doing? Papa. Oh, you want Dada? Are you going home with Mama? Don't you want to go home? See the puppies? She's putting the dogs up because Bubba's coming back down here. Um, I keep saying you want to go to Mama's house. He said, Papa. Um, give me my food. I'm hangry. Oh, oh. I come with, come bearing gifts. <laughs> I'm starved. You're always starved to be so bony. You always hungry. Well, I was getting ready to go to the house. Little mama, I guess, told me I'm waiting on a telephone call. So, let's walk on up here on the hill. Take a look at this. One thing about it, the property held tight. Didn't go nowhere. Sure, I about got a pond now. It must be young tail. The water was clear, and you can see the milkiness coming. It don't look the greatest in the world, especially up this way. I'm liable to get up here and get soaked. Y'all, I'm 42 year old and I've never seen this much rain in Kentucky. Our entire summer has just been wet. We've not been able to really enjoy much of it because it's rained every day. The day of that flood, it rained 11 inches in three hours. That doesn't happen here. That's why most people didn't have flood insurance. This is the lower bottom. I actually can't get to it right now. But I do have a lot of down trees. There was some uh, mudslides happened. I had a mudslide up there. Like one there, but I mean, considering that one little spot here, and that was up above where the property was done. So there's a culvert here, but it's filled in. Not doing it. Starting to rain. Whoa! I just about bit the big one and fell on my butt. It's raining. You guys know how we roll. My husband is, uh, he's ADD, he is all over the place. Nonetheless, I still love him. I sat in here checking on the rim for my car. We can't find a rim anywhere close, so we had to order one. Hopefully, my rim gets here today because I'm going on two weeks without my car now. I ain't complaining, it's just frustrating. You know, I got two kids and Sean has to go do work stuff every day. That is kind of stressing me out even more than not having water for 16 days just because, you know, I've got my two babies and if I need to jump and go with them, emergency or anything, I need my vehicle ready to roll out. Another note, I was sitting here trying to figure out what's for dinner tonight. I forgot to lay my chicken breast out and it's a big old pack. I forgot to get gallon Ziploc bags so I could separate it when I bought it. So it's the entire big pack of breast. I gotta sit down here and make a meal plan. Before the flood, me and Sean were doing really good. Like we're trying to be as frugal as we possibly can because we're really trying to invest in our business this year. You know, eventually once we can stop invest, I mean, we started from nothing. Food prices are so high, you guys know that. We're all feeling that effect. We were so seriously sticking to a meal plan. We hadn't eaten out in like five days, breakfast, lunch, or dinner, and uh, the flood hit. We kind of got off of that for a couple days. Once we got the generator going and stuff, we did make bologna sandwiches on the um, electric skillet and stuff. But we got to get back to our meal plan and get back to sticking to that and saving money on groceries, saving money wherever we can. You guys, both my kids are napping on the couch. So so that's why I'm outside right now. I was outside earlier talking to you, but 
UPS came. Right now, the driveway to the shop is completely destroyed. The girl that works for us, she's having to park up the road and walk down, but we're having to have the shirts delivered here to the house until we get the driveway fixed. We're supposed to be next in line with the guy that's coming to fix it, and then we can swap that back. But I seen him packing those boxes, and I was like, okay, he's got the shirt boxes there. I was like, where's my rim? Well, he got in the truck and left. I was like, uh -huh. So I came out here to check the mail. They haven't run. And surprisingly, thank you, Mr. UPS guy and he sat it right by the car now mama can get her tire on the rim sean is at the shop and he just called me and he's like look at this and the trees down there a bunch of them are already turning bright red it is just too early one right here and one in the main back back there that's turning yellow and red already too in kentucky anyways august is usually our hottest month it's only 72 right now. It was like 60 when I got up this morning. It's just odd. The Farmer's Almanac said we're supposed to have a super rough winter. We are supposed to be in for one of the coldest winters that we've ever had in Kentucky. Not only that, it's saying we're supposed to start seeing snowfall as early as October. So me and Sean were talking. Yeah, we gotta get prepared. So I gotta make sure my babies have everything that they need to keep them warm. Inside the house, we will have propane heat, but that's only in this living room here, not the rest of the house. Mama brain is going, gotta get my house and my children prepped for winter. Not only that, I have to make sure me and Sean have what we need. I'm pretty much sure Sean is covered. I don't really have anything warm. I do have a jacket. I'm more of a cardigan person. I wear my thin little sweaters because I burn up. But in that case, I need to make sure that I have me some waterproof boots. I guess kind of a snowsuit too. Anyhow, that's what's going on with my mom brain. What'd you give her a bologna sandwich dress? Pretty much. That's the dress you guys, Sean, picked out for her. Where'd you get that? Where did I? I don't know. I think I got that from him. He got it on Amazon. Yeah. Right there is what y'all call the perfect bologna sandwich. Now throw you a slice of mater or whatever you want on there. But that right there is how it's done. Look, how, look what I got, guys. Look how teeny he is. Oh, Lord. He's so little. He was under Chloe's shoe. But thank God he can't hurt nothing. You guys, I'm telling you, I don't know what it is. I hope this is the last little booger I find this year. There you go, little buddy. It never fails when these kids see us side by side. Do they want to ride it? Why must you want to ride? Why? Don't why me on why I'm asking you why. Listen, you got popsicle mouth. Okay. And Cheetos. No. Yeah, you eat chippies. Yeah. Have you had fun playing outside? Hey. Yeah. So what are you going to do this winter when it starts snowing? You want to go inside? 
Bye bye. What if I told you Mamma was coming up so we can go to the grocery store? Bubble. You wanna see it with Mamma? Cheese. <laughs> see, I told you your Mamma was coming. You thought I was flibbing, didn't you? Is that sugar? Listen, now we're gonna have to have a talk about that. You get them sugared up, and then you take off and leave, and you leave us with the wild chaos. Say, Mamma, no, no, no. Tell her. Say, no, no, no. Hi, baby. Oh, man. Oh, man. Y'all have destroyed this porch. Oh, it looks like a tornado is just ripped through here on my porch with crayons. What are you barking at? The bugs are relentless here right now. I mean bad. I'm getting eat up. Look at my feet. Look at this. This is just from a while ago. Just walking around in the yard playing with the kids. They have eat me alive. I ain't seen the bugs here this bad. And I know it's just because everything's wet, swampy like. It's just the mosquitoes and gnats are everywhere. And listen, they're coming out with a vengeance. Ow! Y'all, I'm ready to go inside. I've been out here long enough. I'm about to call him out right now, y'all. No. We went and got some groceries and went, the kids are hungry. Sean's mom's like, they're hungry. So we just stopped and got them nuggets. Cause it's 7.30, it's too late to cook dinner. And Sean's like, yeah, the nuggets, the fries, that's all. And I said, well, get me a junior bacon. He said, excuse me, she's got a last minute request. You doing all right, bud? She wants to add yeah, three yeah. junior bacons. Letting her gab. Yeah, huh? he added three junior bacons and blamed it you. on me. I got you. Yeah. Is he, it, <laughs> see what I'm saying? I'm Whose Junior Bacons was it? Yours. 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 So, seeing she tried to call me out on the the burgers, what about you saying you dread packing all these groceries inside <laughs> when she looked, never packs a single one in? She'll get the bread. I looked at Sean and I said, man, I sure dread packing all these groceries in. I usually take the eggs and the bread in. Yeah, she takes the eggs and the bread and then here I am left packing That's what every you get for lying else. and saying all three of these was mine. They was. Sean. You see me eat one and you... I have never eat three burgers in my life. Yes, you do all the time, Megan. That's you. No. Get the proofs on Facebook. Oh, man, we just about... Uh, yeah, buddy, we had the green light, all of us. Yeah, he about took that guy out on a motorcycle. Let's go so I can pack these groceries in. I can pack these groceries in. So I'm... They all know they're your junior bacons and I pack the groceries in. While wow, she's cramming her face full of the junior <laughs> bacon. Well, what? stick that in your junior bacon hole. Y'all look. Gosh almighty, Sean, this is heavy. Megan, <laughs> are you serious? That's jogging pants. This bread is heavy. God, look. All right, you're carrying this them all. This is what you're doing to me. She's carrying them, <laughs> and she's left this for me. You mean them bottles of water is heavy? I'll trade you. <laughs> well, that finally come. Get this thing off that weird lean it's sitting on tomorrow. I guess we're actually gonna go get our tires put on tomorrow. I got two new ones up there. I got some winter tread. Turns out these tires are not bad. It was just cause she bent the rim when she hit that hole, but it's actually got a little hairline crack in there. And it could get worse. That might have been able to beat out, but it would always had a rim leak, so I'd rather just get another rim. And I didn't want to get these. I hate these rims. Like, you don't understand. I don't like them. I don't like a chrome rim. It's not me. I'm not the chrome rim kind of guy. I was going to downsize these. This car's got 22s on it. I was going to downsize them. Put some 20s on it. Maybe some 5 stars, black 5 stars, powder coated, something like that. But this happened and it just knocked all that off course. Anymore, I swear, the more I look at leasing vehicles, the more I think it's smart because they take care of everything for you. If it messes up, it's took care of. If this thing messes up, it's on our dime. Like, just sometimes I feel like leasing, you may, you never own it, but we own the truck, we own the Suburban. I'm about to get that thing tagged. That's what I'm gonna be driving this winter. I'm parking my F-150 because it's never been drove in the snow. It's never had salt on it from when they treat the roads during the winter time. So I'm gonna park it, keep her in good shape. Eventually, I'm gonna do something with it, swap motors, do something else, because I love that truck, and after 
everything it went through with helping the people of our county i can't get rid of it i can't sell it it means more to me now than it ever did i got some plans for the f-150 could be 10 years could be one of them it never anything gets done it just sits there and i say i'm gonna fix that one of these days you watch and see this what the um you're slacking you should have already had these groceries put up what yeah you're slacking huh you're slacking I'm what oh I'm you guys guy. look Tis the season for everything pumpkin. Fa -la, 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 um, la la Can we talk about something? That's peanut butter. I thought I got. Did we get pumpkin? Oh no. Sean, I know you grabbed pumpkin. Yes, my wife is one of the pumpkin spice crew. Look at the hair, guys. Pumpkin cookie dough with cream cheese. Flakes. Boom. So, how about this? Good cup of coffee in the morning with pumpkin munchkin, munchkin, pumpkin munchkin, and pumpkin cookies. Tell her no, no, no. Yeah, I laugh. It's, I am. it's so funny. It was funny. I just socks. My socks are in the dirty clothes because they got poop on them. <laughs> Colton just walks up to me and goes, Bleh! and I'm like, He's what? Asleep. And then I. He just got up from a nap, and I'm like, I smell poop. And then I look down, and it's all over my leg. It's all over his hand. I don't know, like, if he went to scratch his butt and found out, oh, no, I pooped. But I just got the poop bomb. <laughs> but with that being said, that's a poopy situation, and we're going to end this vlog here. I hope you guys really enjoyed this one. I'm putting a little more time and effort into these vlogs. I don't know if you could tell. If you could tell that it was better, just the whole production, the structure, if you like the way it looked, and just let me know down below. I'm kind of getting to where I really like adding these cinematic shots in and also just the music and everything. I think it makes for a better experience. Why did you wipe poop on that act? Daddy, I don't think you know what you did. Listen, you don't wipe poop on me once. I guess he thought it was a present. But not to mention I am already working on another video. Should be able to get it up. Let's see, this one is going up. Today is Wednesday. Good Lord willing, Friday there'll be another video. So make sure you turn them notification bells on. Hit that like button because that's one way that YouTube's going to let you know that we put up a video. So every time you hit like, it just registers that you've interacted with the channel. And it's like, okay, they've got another video for you to interact with. Leave us a comment. Poopy head. All right, guys. We love y'all. And until the next time. Stay positive, guys. Stay country. Stay true to your roots. Bye.